leadership has always been a constant issue in Nigeria. But there seems to be a difference this time, as Nigerians are awake from their slumber and are ready to get it right. As you all know, we have less than three months to the 2023 general election, and we are out here seeking the opinions of concerned Nigerians or which of the parties they think stands a better chance in the 2023 general election. Nigerians are asking for a patriotic, competent and selfless leader who would not only ensure unity, but make the country a better place, even for generations to come. A law-abiding citizen, someone who is willing to do the needful, someone who will listen to the masses, someone who will listen to our problems and profile good solutions. We want somebody that is competent. We want somebody that will, that will really work hard to make Nigeria better. We want somebody that will definitely provide. That's what we want. That's what we are looking at. For us to come out of this suffering, we have to make a right choice. The choice that we see for our children, not even us, because we are getting older, then the young ones, we need to lead them to the right path, whereby they will not be crying like we are crying now, or like we are working up and down to make things work for us. So we vote wisely. We know the right candidate. If you look into Nigerian situation, um, our leadership are not getting it right because they are looking. They are not looking at the back. If they can look back, the deep shit poverty they enrich, they come from. If they look back very well, and they think in the situation they are now, they are in a good life. If they think back, they will use that thinking to give Nigeria dividends of democracy, fundamental human rights, rule of law, and give Nigeria sustainable, sustainable living. I will encourage our leaders who are, who are in the hierarchy to come together and put their hand on the decks to help the country for a better place. We are appealing. We are not forcing them. We are appealing to our leaders, our fathers who are in the corridor of power to come together, put themselves together, and make sure that the unity of this country is their number one priority to look into. Selecting the right leader has become a difficult challenge as Nigerians tend to struggle with indecision towards the upcoming 2023 general elections as a result of several failed promises from politicians over the years. Present in our both BDP, APC, uh, what's the name? Uh, NMPP. Huh? I'm putting it to you now, left to me. I don't have anybody I want. Uh, I have in mind yet. I still want to study their party manifesto. So when I've studied their party, party manifesto, any any one of them that I see, yes, he has a conscience to fix Nigeria, to give Nigerian dividends of democracy, fundamental human rights, to improve welfare and well-being of Nigeria, welfare and well-being of Nigeria, and give Nigeria sustainable living and rule of law. And I consider that person that the presidential candidate I'm going to vote. Apparently I would say I don't have, but I want to believe that the, uh, the person who will perform and the most populous person should emerge as the winner of the presidential election. All I can say is, till when the election comes, 